Yo, YouTube, it's your boy TSO Sage. I'm live with my brother Benjamin, and we're here to talk about why Stephen Curry never has a bad game featuring gravity. <laughs> Defenders are fighting for their lives oh trying God, to guard it's... Curry, and he doesn't even have the ball. Yo, that camera is crisp. <laughs> I was about to say, yeah, I gotta look at my boy. He's hey, looking man. HD as fuck, man. Hey, hey, man, I need those. I ain't gonna lie. I got the bootleg set up, MJ. I'm helping nigga. <laughs> Help a nigga out, man. You already know. A nigga like me. I don't even get paid over here. Like, I'm bored. Chat, help me. What he's saying is like the video. That's what he's saying. Uh, what he's saying is this goes to Benjamin. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> Imagine him with the ball. What does that even look like? Tough curry of the three. Got it. Oh. Wow. Yeah. He's built different. He's him. What is up, dudes, cadets, ballers, players? It's your boy MJ. Hopefully, y'all know about Stephen Curry's gravity at this point, but uh -oh. if you don't, oh, a player's him. gravity is their ability to draw defenders towards them. Basically, how strongly do they attract defenders? It can be with the ball, without the ball, in the paint, on the three point line, at the half court line. For example, a player like Giannis will draw multiple defenders in the paint, but draw no one on the perimeter. Westbrook gets no one. Jesus. Yeah. Jesus. Why? Oh my god. The rest is like the little bro, bro. Like, like, let me make fun of Cub, but that damn, bro. Why, man? Why? Sage, that's a point guard that takes four threes a game. <laughs> you just had to do it. <laughs> you, 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 just, you just had to mention that. You know, all the shit where they, they go on Brody for, at least that left wing midi kind of going down a bit more. He made that bitch over Miles Turner the other night. Yeah. What about that? Yeah. 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 Whatever, whatever makes you sleep at night, Sage. What you say, nigga? <laughs> whatever makes you sleep at night, bro. All right. Yeah. <laughs> I can't sleep at night. Okay, hey guys! Curry's gravity is so great that it creates so many opportunities for other players. It can be plays like this, where two defenders end up chasing Curry without the ball, oh my God. which literally leaves a wide Damn. open player. Damn! <laughs> That's so bad, or though. It could even be the attention that defenders have. Easy like, work. instead of watching the ball, they're watching Stephen Curry and losing track of their matchup. And the most common with great shooters. The defense cannot help off Stephen Curry. And so the rest of the Warriors get easier lanes to the hoop, okay. more one-on-one -on -one matchups, just an easier time on offense. Even in this game in which Curry has shot 39% oh, from voice the field, got deep as shit. Oh god. <laughs> three, look at what the Kings are doing. <laughs> they are doubling Curry in the backcourt. Man has put the fear of God in them. That's wow. cool. Draymond just rushes through the four on three opportunity and Wiggins That's gets nuts. fouled. Or even here. Nah, that Wiggins is OD. I ain't, so I, I ain't down Curry gravity, but I hope that's not the only trap. reason he can't just have a bad game. Curry from the half of a second I, well, I can't rock with those. To get three, which lets the Warriors play four on three. This happens a lot. The high traps happen because teams are just like, screw it, get Curry out of the play. We'll deal with the 4v3 because that's better than letting Curry have the ball. Yeah, that sounds about right. Which is of facts. course, when Curry has a great game, it's electric. When he's making shots, it's a barrage. It's demoralizing for the other team. This motherfucker doing the oh same my God. off ball moves. He is nah. crazy. I, 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 I Curry got the best highlights of, like, I, I don't know of all time, all time, but it, he has the most game. enjoyable highlights to me. I'm sorry, talk over that bro video like that. <laughs> but he definitely, he definitely do get the most enjoyable highlights to me. I swear to God, bro. I will watch Curry highlights all fucking day. Him and Kyrie. Kyrie's is, ugh. Because every time you watch a Kyrie highlight, you see a play that you ain't never seen. And you're just like, what the, when did he do that? And then he'll do some shit like nutmeg a motherfucker, snatch it back and then shoot over him. And you're like, what the? Why you like this? Especially one where he wasn't statistically that great. We can actually see the impact that's not in the box scores. So let's do that. Subscribe okay. if you're liking the video so far, because I'm going to be doing more of this. And drop a like. It really helps recommend this video to other people yes, so that sir. everyone can finally realize Curry's gravity. Let's aim for the amount Support of threes Curry's in his career. 2,884. I'm out here in California recording in a closet, so that's why there's no face cam, but... <laughs> uh, <laughs> My man be hitting double puberty on some shit. <laughs> hey, nah. hey, the voice just gets way deeper. <laughs> God dang. MJ is a clone. <laughs> I'm just gonna say, MJ is a clone. Someone is not who they think they are. It might not be the person on camera. I don't trust this face cam, nigga. It might be the closet, <laughs> motherfucker. For one of them niggas is fraud, and we gotta come down and find out, dude. 
Let's pick this game. Curry shot 40% from the field, 27% from three. He did have nine assists, but this was still one of his worst games statistically this season. He's right. also a negative one in the plus minus. Right. So this has to be a bad game for him, right? Right? The Warriors won by 22. Ayo, what? Alright, so let's look at the first part. Okay. Draymond runs to the wing, Curry is running to the ball. Here, a lot of the time, this defender would reach or maybe do a bump and the defender on the back hip may switch the guy that's on the perimeter. That would stop a drive. But Rozier is locked on Curry, so he does nothing and Draymond gets all the way to the paint. Because of this, Plumlee rotates over to stop the drive. Okay. Looney dives in to be a pass target, Lamelo picks up Looney and Poole is wide open all because I can't initially the defense didn't even want to give half a second to curry even here curry's pump gets miles all the way out near the logo Plumley steps up and that's a wide open pool all right i ain't gonna lie to them last two i fuck y'all already know i fuck with wardelli is crazy that's a defense having defense who's gonna let any nba player pump fake and then just drive and just not stop him trying to go to the basket. Like, you're a big man. You're going to slide over. If it's just the gravity doesn't mean he can have a bad game. If his standards are to hit the fucking threes, he don't hit the threes. It's a bad game. <laughs> if his standards is to be that plus hit the shots and then he doesn't hit the shots, it's a bad game. And then if he turning the ball over, it's a bad game. But maybe he could convince me, though. But right now, I'm just like kind of ignorantly stuck on that. <laughs> no cap. I'm gonna focus on Curry's passing this game because it was really good, but we're trying to see Curry's gravity without the ball. Also, notice how Poole is getting easy buckets. A lot of these plays in the first quarter are really <laughs> important for Jordan Poole, who has been struggling from three to this point of the season. He was shooting oh my God, 44% foul. from three, but this game he oh, ends dang. up getting 31 getting hot early on here i didn't know shooting 24 through instead of saying this man we don't look at a fit we don't look at metrics for the pool party the, the hell the room, but we just let him ball trap. miles is also ball watching and now he's he definitely behind ball watching. because pool has moved draymond runs the two-on-one game with pool lamello comes back late Ooh, miles is already a step behind from ball watching and now pool who is already feeling it makes a shot look at this box out by curry the small things the small thing. Oh my god. That's what I was saying. Oh, he <laughs> got a gas in it. <laughs> but it's, it's now has an open lane. Going to his right, which is his strong side. Now, this defender has to help and leaves Iggy wide open for three. What does Curry have to do with that play, though? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm not trying to be on my boy Schmeet. MJ, no cap. Hop off Curry dick. Ain't gonna lie. <laughs> MJ, my brother. You know I love him, but I can't lie. I can't lie. That's the Hornets are just a, a stupid idiot defense. I gotta say, like they have the potential. I believe that one day they'll be good, but right now, don't none of them niggas even care about defense. Let alone are they good at it. To be completely transparent, the reason why I chose this video is because on Twitter Spaces, follow me on Twitter. Us oh, on Twitter. You know what I'm saying, yeah, but not ready. There have been these conversations regarding Stephen Curry not even capable of having a bad game. And MJ specifically in this video, he hinted at like other players having gravity, but specifically on those Twitter spaces I was in, they were dead ass talking about how like Curry just can't, can't have a bad game because he's different from the other guys. They went on to explain what MJ's explaining right now, which is gravity. And for the most part, like I agree, like every time Curry's on the floor, he is a threat. That is a guy you do not want to get hot. You play defense differently when he's on the court than when he's not. But to say that he's the only player that that applies to just isn't true. A lot of star players in general are going to be a net positive because of what they bring to the game on average. They're going to play defense differently when they're on the court. I just don't believe that this case right here, and I don't know if MJ is going to say it later in the video, is exclusive to Curry. I would say no, it's not exclusive to Curry. Other players have gravity. Other players have different threats to the game. But to say that they can't have a bad game just isn't true. When we say players have a bad game, it's always relative. When LeBron choked in 2011 as a threat, as a player, because we know on average he's averaging, what, 28, 8, and 8, they're going to play defense, you know, differently when he's on the court versus when he's not. He's still a threat when he's on the court. But relative to what we expect from him, him averaging 18, 6, and 6, which is still great for an average player, is bad for him. That's why it's a it's a bad series, a bad game, a bad performance. Stephen Curry is not incapable of having a bad game. When he didn't have a shot going, the eight rebounds, the box outs, the defense, nope. All of this was created with Steph having an A game, and most of these plays I'm showing 
or him without the ball. Like, what about this play? Curry passes and immediately dives to the paint, eventually setting a screen for Damian Lee. And as you can see right here, Cody Martin is still fixated on Curry and does not react to Lee cutting to the rim, even as Lee is bumping him. And by that point, it's too late. Great pass by Bielitsa to take advantage of that and easy bucket. This is a bad Steph game this season, and you should know by now what happens with the good games. Make it interesting. We did one. I remember one, that nigga, one. nigga was horny for that shit. I'm from the logo with it. A few moments hey, nah, that later. Crap. Green is in a torture chamber and outside Woo! it goes Curry. Oh, with him! Even these plays don't acknowledge the constant crazy pressure Paul Steph puts back. on defense <laughs> by just being on the floor. Defenses are stretched out. Hey, yo. Stretched out. What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? <laughs> Fuck stretched out. Curry fucked us, bro. We had Blaze Mower and AB on it. <laughs> he fucked us up, bro. I hate my team, bro. God <laughs> damn, I hate these niggas. Get out of my sight. Guarding him from half court, the pick and roll being five plus feet beyond the three point line, it's a nightmare for defenses who are constantly just trying to not make a single mistake. Like this play for Gary Payton. Look how tightly the on ball defender is on Curry at the logo. GP comes up for a screen and the big man is ready to have to step up to stop Curry from pulling up. But Gary Payton fakes the screen. Now the big man's way behind GP and Curry passes to Iggy who's gonna have the perfect angle to pass it to Gary Payton. And you get this. Absolute great I'm not trying to drag it into the mud because we said like three times but like that that's Dame or James Harden easily. Jay, and I'm saying I bring James Harden up as well because James Harden isn't even known for his logo range or anything like that. But James Harden has literally drawn full court defenses in the playoffs and struggled with that full court defense. And that's why he's often looked as a playoff choker. Damian Lillard obviously has the range, obviously has made the strides as a playmaker. That's literally not exclusive. I ain't gonna hold you. Like that that's that's just being good at the game. All of this is happening and I had oh my even God, Schmicks. about Curry's Schmicks. drive. That's just a nasty play. <laughs> Schmicks. And, oh yeah, okay, Curry playing defense. Good. See he could have talked about that. Hey, yo, yeah. Pause at defense. And what about his actual scoring? The reason why Curry has this much gravity is because these are the same type of moves he does to get open. The same movements he does to fool defenders to get half a second of daylight to pull the trigger. There are players who have said that Curry sometimes seems more dangerous without the ball than with it. And all it takes is a look from another Warriors player to Curry for defenders to be worried that there's a pass coming and over committing. No, I mean no Durant, man Clinton. already has a 50 Fuck point it. tennis this game this season when scoring is way down and when a lot of stars ain't really looking like stars. Mm. What the hell was that? Nah, yeah, that, so he had a said, brain fart Curry's crazy on that. can't truly be captured in stats. And one! The offense revolves what the f around Curry and his gravity. <laughs> I was sitting, watching, analyzing the Warriors this year, and now I'm out of the hyperbolic time chamber. This is one of Anime. three videos I'm making on Steph Curry and the Warriors to analyze the offense and their defense, so stay okay. tuned. These Curry videos about to curry a bunch of NBA YouTubers. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> Is <laughs> it's curry season, bitch. Yo, if you're trying to grow a, a YouTube channel, curry, <laughs> brawn. If Russ has a bad game, make a Russ That's video. That's it. And if you ever get down bad, throw Simmons in there. <laughs> Just throw Simmons. Don't miss it. If you ever get down bad, throw Ben Simmons in there. You'll be great. <laughs> Kyrie gonna say some dumb shit in like two weeks. Just wait for that and then make a video on that. If you have to be a a, a content whore, it's not that hard. I and mean, <laughs> being a content whore in the NBA is not that hard. Just go on the Lakers, talk about somebody underrated once every seven videos, and then just predict something or do a top ten something or compare somebody. You'll be fine. Also, Easy that's time. his jokes. That that's not to MJ specifically. Just you know. I'm all for slander content creators, but MJ, my dog. Is Everything he said in this video regarding Curry's offense is true. That's what makes Curry such a deadly offensive weapon everything he said is is valid the only problem again that, that i have is this idea that it's only curry i don't even know if, if if mj specifically specified that it's just curry that can't have a bad game a lot of the stuff that he said in this video does apply to other players as well like Giannis, i guess can't have a bad game like kd can't have a bad game lebron can't have a bad game yeah, lebron really can't have a bad game dennis rodman can't have a bad game because you know he he brings defense to the game and as long as he's playing good defense every single game, you know, he can't have a bad game. Good good video, though, MJ. If you guys like this video, 
watch this video right here. Reacted to some some highlights, some no look passes, some crazy plays. Curry's in there. I don't know what to tell you. Curry's in there. <laughs> uh, <laughs> hey, all right. Yeah, disclaimer. Curry's a him. We just, just wilding. Sorry, fuck up the outside out. 